What is going on, Draconians? Draco Invictus here with episode 24 of our revisited series of Night of the Dead. It is hour 11 on day 23, and I am playing around with the corner of this building here. I've cleaned up everything, I've repaired everything, I've done all the maintenance stuff that we want to do here, but we have this wide open corner up there and I want to, um, well, I want to see if we can't put something up there. So, uh, let us, uh, lay this out. Let's see. We're going to need one, two, three, four sets of stairs. So two, three, I certainly have enough stuff, so it's, it's a height thing there. This is all just temporary anyway. Let's build that there. And then we will grab some stairs. Well, at least we can walk up here, right? So what else can we do up here? Can we put a bridge? Oh, really? So we can snap a bridge here. Interesting. Very interesting. So can we put a floor there? Very interesting. Okay, now let's see if this is all going to come down if I take out this foundation. Right? That's the... Oh, really? Oh, we're going to have some fun. <laughs> okay, let's hop over here. And we will put another bridge this direction. Oh, I can't probably because of the stairs. I don't necessarily want to take them out just yet. Okay, now we've got some working room here. Let's go to traps and the multiple rocket oh my god this thing is stupidly huge oh i have severely underestimated my little corner of the building <laughs> uh yeah okay um will it even go out here oh it will okay so we may see the problem is it's gonna want to shoot rockets at the damn giant that's over on the other side of that uh, those signs there I think those signs are just going to catch it. And this is not something that we want to stick around with. So it won't go that direction, but it'll go that direction or that direction. Interesting. Can we pull it back at all? No. Okay. Because it's going to have the room to swivel. So it's got a big hitbox. Very, hmm... Yeah, I would have loved it if it could have sat right there. That would have just been badass, right? Just, yeah, out here. Hmm. God, that thing's massive. And no, I haven't made any ammunition for it yet. But the building is supporting it. I know it gets kind of jank with this big massive thing hanging out up there, but we certainly can't put it over there. There's no building on that corner that we could put it on. And I don't want to put anything in here because then that could interfere with the trebuchets or the mortar. Trying to put it where it's going to be out of the way. Interesting. Okay, so let's see what we can do here. Hmm. 
Okay. Let's go with some beams. Nope, not gonna put a beam there. We gotta go beam here. That's all I really need anyway. All right, I'm gonna play around with this for a bit. Enjoy the music.
right, guys. So we got it done. I don't know if it's pointed the right direction. It should spin around. If it's not, <laughs> I have no idea. I also put 30 rounds in it. And I don't know if that's enough or too much. I don't know how fast it fires. We're going to figure all that out here in just a few hours. Uh, but I didn't make any real... I, I think I do want to put a couple uh, just like little spikes in here. A couple little spikes around here. Just kind of, again, always just softening them up. Um, I already did that on this side. Let me show you really quickly. So here I just kind of sprinkled in some... Because they, they come from that corner, so this is going to be their, their lane of travel here for their most direct path. So I took away some that I had over here, and I kind of moved them over here. So the idea is, is that a lot of the lights are barely going to make it through here. As soon as they get up here into the cutter, they're dead. So, I may want to take this light down. Oh, oh my god, I'm going to kill myself. Don't mind me. Let's take this light down, because I saw last night they were raging on that light. We do need to put some lights over here. Um, I think I want to put one, let's see, two, 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 here, here. Oh, good. Plenty of materials. I want to put one here. And then, hmm. Oh, don't do it. I want to put one actually underneath the stairs. So what we may do is demolish this. Demolish that. There we go. And we can build one of these and put it right here. Wait for the save. That's going to give us a lot of light down here at nighttime, uh, so we can see what the hell's going on uh, without having to use our flashlight or hanging it from above. Because the lights are very, very bright, and I'm not complaining about that. That's fantastic. It's exactly what I want. But having it hanging right underneath the floor gives too much brightness underneath on the underside, and you can't see what's below, so... It's a trick. It's a trap. All right, so I'm going to throw some more spikes down here. And then... Go take care of a screamer first. Hiya! That was my Jedi mind tricks. Because I am using a lightsaber, you know. I just, like, forced through that dude. Oh, hello, bird. All right. I'm going to kind of putz around and do some stuff. And if I uh, end up doing something cool, um, obviously, I will record it and show it to you. Otherwise, I'll catch you guys at the horde. All right, guys. It is almost time for the horde. Wave 24, which means that it's going to be a giant kind of a night. I have everything turned on. We've already drained half of the first battery, just turning crap on. So it is going to be... Now, of course, I did walk over the pedals a couple times to make sure everything was working on both sides. So, yeah, these going from nothing to 
uh, standby a couple times. Uh, yeah, it, it, it's going to be a little bit draining. Of course, the uh, the rocket launcher is ready to go. Hopefully, we get a giant from that direction tonight. Uh, it's going to be interesting. So, this is the point in the video where I say, hey, if you're liking this kind of content, smash the crap out of the like button and let YouTube know that this is the kind of content that you want to see. If you're new around here, think about subscribing, clicking the bell notification icon so that you may or may not get notified when a new video or I go live or anything like that pops up. And um, yeah, leave a comment and watch the videos. All those things are free, by the way. Subscribing is free here on YouTube. If you're coming over from Twitch, subscribing is like following on Twitch. Because I know that subscribing on Twitch is like joining here. Speaking of joining, if you want to help the channel in a more personal way, if you want to become part of the Draco Nation and help decide how we kind of mold this channel together and this community, then uh, go ahead and click on the join button down below. You get access to all the badges and emotes and all that stuff. Any tier doesn't matter. And or you can check the description down below uh, links to my Patreon. If you want to just buy me a cup of coffee, you could do that, too. So all those ways help me strive toward the goal of creating the best community on YouTube. And I just want to thank you. I want to take a moment to say thanks to everyone that tunes in and watches the videos and watches my antics and me be an idiot. I appreciate it. I really, really do. Let's get on to the horde, huh? All right, guys, here we go. Horde 24. take just a moment and say holy shit that thing's badass
Ladies and gentlemen, Wave 24. And I'm going to say it again. Holy crap, that thing is a badass. All right. Uh, I think that this was a very successful wave. Let's go ahead and get this turned off. I do need... Again, I noticed that these mini guns were shooting this direction and they couldn't have been hitting anything. I can't imagine unless they were literally shooting this gap right here. So I may have to find uh, do like more switches that turn the mini guns off just because that ammo is so much more expensive to make than the uh, than the spike thrower ammo is. So let's get everything turned off. Let's take a look at our batteries, see how we did. All right, one and a half. Let's go ahead and turn that off. Those can start recharging. And we almost drained all of our power over here. Holy cow. Just because we were letting so many through the the first floor is all tied up here so uh we will have to look at uh more batteries all right uh let's uh kind of wander through really quickly and um see how we did all right killed a few over here obviously killed quite a few over here oh yeah lots died right here oh yeah this is what you want to see just bags piled on top of bags so let's see how far they got tonight um they didn't get far <laughs> yeah one made it to this point yeah So we will, uh, we'll definitely take that as a win. We're almost there to optimization, I think. Where we're not just wasting stuff. Yep, this, this is how we do it right here. We're going to take back this whole island. All right, guys, that, oh, let's go find our giant. We made short work of him. Well, he wasn't one of the green ones, so. But yeah, that, that thing is ridiculous. Oh, look at They died way back here. Yeah, that this might be the furthest back that I've seen any die. That's pretty awesome. And of course, I have to go look up on the top of the hill, too. That's become the, the norm is wandering back up there. All right, guys, that is going to wrap it up for this episode. Uh, yeah, day 24, wave 24, episode 24. Hey, we're out of the teens. All right, guys, if you have any questions, comments, kicks, complaints, go ahead and leave them down in the comment section below. Uh, new around here, subscribe, click the bell notification icon, smash the crap out of that like button. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you thought. Everything helps. Appreciate it all. And until next time, you take care of yourselves out there. This is Draco Invictus saying this has been the best day of my life. See ya.